Uh, I didn't think how we were going to start this. <laughs> yeah, alright, so I feel uh, like this is wasted footage. Yeah, but that's okay, because there's the whole editing software that I have. That You're right. Do you reckon they can hear Harry Potter in the background? <laughs> Probably. Can we close it up yeah. for me? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm here with my uh, super attractive, super intelligent, all round good what? guy, oh. <laughs> Mr. Early Hoos. Um, so we decided that there are a whole bunch of things that we wish we could say to our girlfriends, both now, in the future, in the past, all the time, and it's just a little bit hard. It's a little... Uh, so we're going to make this video for you, mm. for you girlfriends. Mm. Um, we're going to show this to you and then it'll just have been said. Done deal. out there. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure every guy out there Everyone has this has. problem. Let's yeah. say you're just going, you've just seen a nice movie, nice romantic movie. You're just like, hey, you want to go for some ice cream? Just a cheeky little bit of ice cream. Yeah. Sweet. Maybe you head to Gelatismo. Get some gourmet stuff in. You're feeling like a bit of sweetness after your movie, and that's cool. Exactly. Everyone does. That's fine. Everyone does. Who doesn't want that? So you get to the ice cream store. You go You go to your girlfriend. Hey, what do you want? Uh, no, you look, I don't think I'm feeling like it. I think I'll, I think I'll be fine. You know, I'm good. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, yeah, I'm going to get something. Now, you've gotten your double scoop. There you're it like, is. You're, like, ready to dive in. You're like, oh, jealous. Here's my double scoop. Yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah, nice. And then you got your buddy girlfriend... Your bloody girlfriend. Oh, okay, can, can I just have a bite? No! You said you didn't want any. If you didn't want any, you don't get any. That's, that's how it goes. There ain't no half measures here. Yeah, it's like if you approach, if you started it with, hey, how about we share something? Maybe I might agree. But you set the scene. You said, no, I do not want any of this food. So girls, seriously, pick up your shit. I'm going to flirt with your mum. It's just... Yeah, look. It's just a thing that's going to happen, and you need to accept it. Although, like, yeah, although you think you know me quite well, honestly, I might just be hanging out with you for your hot mum. Yes, you look fat in that. They're just not flattering. Why did you buy it? <laughs> it looks awful. Damn. Who wears floral? Like... I'm going to be honest, my girlfriend wears a lot of floral. And, and you look beautiful. <laughs> And that's okay, it's no one's fault. No one needs to get no, in trouble You're just not that. born for that item of clothing. You look gorgeous in other things. Yeah, you look sh crap. <laughs> <laughs> just look stick with what's comfortable. Yeah, what you stick... already know you look okay in. Yes, your mates are hot. Mm. Alright, so there's this thing that girls like to do. And that is cuddle. Midday, night, cuddling in the morning. Just in cuddling. the car. In the bed. Everywhere. In the shower, if you're lucky enough to shower together. Uh, so look, girls oh. love to cuddle, and that's mm. awesome, because we love to cuddle as well. Yeah. Little known fact, guys love the cuddle. We don't admit it, but you it's know, true. Love a good cuddle. But here's the thing, ladies. In the middle of summer, when it's 40 degrees Celsius, mm. you need to get your shit off of me. Mm. You just stop, stop touching me. Mm. I want to cuddle you, not your sweat. Yeah, I don't want to be bathed in a pool of your, of your bodily fluids. Right. I just don't want that. You're right. Or do I? It's pretty much the same as saying you're fat. Look, you're awesome. Based purely on the fact that we don't date girls who aren't awesome, you have to be an amazing human being. Would make sense. Uh, so you need to quit being so damn sensitive. You are lovely. You're funny. My mm. friends like you. You need to just calm down. Yeah. Right? It's just not an issue. It's just not a thing. <laughs> <laughs> if you leave me with your family, I will have to murder you. Mm. That's that's just a thing. Especially if I've just met them. No matter how comfortable I seem, I am crapping myself. <laughs> you can't go to the toilet. Hold that in. Like dead set. Your father wants to kill me. This is now the 14th friend I've met. I just don't care oh. anymore. I stopped caring up to after number three, and I stopped listening to names at all after mm. number ten. Yeah, like, look, you and your 200 closest friends don't. No. Don't need to meet them all. No. Uh, we can we can meet Honestly, spread them out. I'm sorry. Apparently we've been talking for 10 minutes. I don't even know your name. <laughs> we know that you think you're good at X. Mm. Uh, be that singing or dancing. Singing is a big one. But you're a little bit shit. Yeah. And it's hard to tell you that. I don't want my eardrums to bleed. 
No, you're... Yeah. You, you're all good. Yeah, that's an interesting way to interpret that song. I like the way you, um, yeah, you kind of just brought out the true... I like the, the way you meaning. screeched. Hmm. Well, Look, just a quick note. To anyone out there who could be my girlfriend, literally none of these things apply to you. Um... Except the floral thing. <laughs> <laughs> you got I this, this love your given. style. I do love you in floral. Um, because we love you. You're awesome. Don't stop being awesome. And please don't get angry at us for making this film, please. None of it applies to you, I'm so sorry. Sam made me. <laughs> Sam doesn't even have a girlfriend. So this, this is all on me. This all. Anyways, uh, it's been Ollie, it's been Sam, we've had fun. Peace. Sam!